Well, even as the Omar Abdullah government to Delhi police tussle over the issue of Hizbul terrorist leader Akhar Ali Khan, headlines today has learned that the alleged fidaeen was in touch with Pakistan embassy officials in Kathmandu right before crossing over to India. Well, sources have told headlines today that Delhi police has traced clinching evidence against him. He is believed to have been in touch with other terror outfits as well. As per sources, Liaquat was in contact with the Herikul Jihad, Al Barq, and Hezbul Mujahideen operators. He is also believed to have been in touch with his handlers in the Pakistani embassy in Kathmandu. These details have been found from Liaquat's cell phone. Well, Jammu and Kashmir police may have contradicted Delhi police's version on Liaquat's arrest and the Hezbollah plot to carry out attacks in the capital, but the Delhi police is fully backing its investigations and in fact insists that a sinister terror plot was in the works. He's now being quizzed by the sleuths of the Intelligence Bureau and Research and Analysis Wing. But in the meantime, Delhi police has released a sketch of a suspected Hezbollah Mujahideen terrorist who is linked to the suicide attack plot. The sketch is that of a person who checked into the guest house in Old Delhi and left there an AK-56 and ammunition allegedly for Liyakat Ali Shah. Police has covered arms and ammunition for the guest house following the interrogation of Shah and are trying to nab alleged Fidayin with the help of the sketch. The cops claimed that they had busted a major terror plot in the capital in the run-up to Holi.